Good evening, everyone. Today is January 1st, the first very day first of the year. day of the year. We are ready. We are live. We'll look to the replay. Uh, but yesterday, this was something that uh, Braxton was asking me, my son. Why do I have this peanut? And I was going to talk about that today. Today is uh, Wednesday, and I tackle spiritual things um, on Wednesdays, like uh, the mind on Mondays. And we did top 10 Tuesdays, but uh, Wednesdays is really for spirit. So we go through mind, body, spirit, finances, uh, social interactions, and today, spirit. And it's really going to be talking, uh, tackling what this peanut represents, okay? Okay. So... We're going to be de deepening our belief systems in either ourselves or God or someone else or whatever you want to deepen in. So we're going to get started. Ready? Ready. Ready, ready. <laughs> All right, so deepening our beliefs and what this peanut represents is uh, I did a little a little post not long ago, uh, maybe November, October or November about the peanut and the peanut has uh, so many uses. I, I think it was over 300 uses for the peanut and it was like over 600 uses for the uh, the sweet potato. But if God can get so many uses out of a peanut, just think of what he can do with a living, breathing, uh, complex mind thinking person who believes in themselves. That's what this is. So I wanted to deepen belief. And I was listening to Dr. Norman Vincent Peale, and he was talking about the six X's. And six X's is kind of like the process in the expansion of your belief or the deepening of your belief system. So I keep this, I got one in my car. I, I, I think I have one at work too, but I just keep that. So whenever I'm thinking that uh, I'm not creative mm -hmm. or on the verge of being a little useless, I can look at this peanut and say, if God can do something with this peanut, I mean, surely he can help me because he loves me. He loves you too. So the first X, these are six X's. The first X is exposure to something. You get a sense of awe or uh, when, you, when, you, when you look at this peanut, you kind of look at it and it's, it's kind of ordinary if you've never seen a peanut before here's one if you've never seen one before that's you being exposed to it or when you're coming in contact with god for the first time and you hear these stories or these ideas you're coming in contact with it and that's the exposure and you kind of like hmm what what what's going on here and you're being exposed to it that's the very very first step to that deepening that faith uh faith comes by hearing right and when you hear it then you're exposed to it and the second thing after that is the explanation of it so we kind of ponder the things and i when i'm at church i try to give a kind of like a bam, right in your face type of thing where you know like what, what does that mean you're exposed to it you don't know anything about it then you get an explanation that's the second x explanation so when you're deepening your faith in yourself or anything else you're exposing yourself to new ideas and things like that what the process that i go through is listening to tapes or um cds or audiobooks and then getting the idea and then let it get uh letting them really explain it to me explain what's happening what did do, what does this mean which takes me to the next step so i can get an understanding of it 
uh, then we experiment. <clears throat> George Washington Carver, when he took the peanut, he understood it. Uh, well, there was exposure to it. He exposed himself to it. Then he started to experiment and really try things out. What does work? What works for me? What what doesn't work for me? What's my passion? What's my purpose? What do I need to do to make myself better? So I get exposed. I get the explanation. You know, you can get explanation of your purpose through your communication with God. And then you go through that explanation and then the experiment where you start to test it out. Okay. The things that's on the inside of you, if you feel that child care is your thing, which is child care is your thing. The things that come to you, you test it out. You see if it works. You see if the kids respond to it a certain way. Uh, because what works for adults doesn't necessarily work for kids. Once you fully understand your niche, then you can take it a step further into experience. You you take you go from experimenting trying this and that to an experience taking what you've mastered or what your purpose or your passion is and really running with it <clears throat> once you do that you turn that into an experience then you can actually turn it into an expression you go from experience to expression now what you do with the experience how it turns into an expression is how you spread it out how you make it apply to various things like i've said you mastered it in a certain way since you've mastered it now the next step is to be able to apply it to different things so once you have unblocked yourself that's what we're doing is unblocking ourselves then you can unblock your mind then you can unblock your your physical your body then you can unblock your spiritual experiences unblock your finances unblock your social interactions you're starting to take that unblocking concept and applying it to diff different things and the last thing about this whole process is expansion this is you you went from being exposed to it to the expansion of it where you are really able to teach you can take what your experiences are your expressions of it and then teach it to other people so they can unblock themselves and step by step they'll go through that same process and start to teach others and then you'll see the things that were birthed on the inside of you exponentially start to move throughout the nation the world the universe so those are the six steps. Any thoughts on that? I think that those steps were excellent. It's the seventh X. It's excellent. <laughs> Thank you, honey. You're welcome, dear. So take those things and uh, really I'll, I'll have it in the show notes and I will have it uh, on the screen too as I was talking. But take that go from being exposed to those thoughts and those ideas to being able to layer it down and get a good foundation and then go out and teach teach the things that it's really on the inside of you you're way worth way more than a peanut so and this has a lot of uses <laughs> <laughs>